So hey guys, welcome to the new video. Today in this video, we are going to see that how can you create a digital clock using your Python code. In this video, we will be using our, our Tinker module, which is a GUI based module uh, required for, you can say, creating basic GUI apps. So let's move in our VS code firstly. Just go in file tab here and then open folder and then you have to select your desired folder okay then since uh, tick enter or tinker what is whatever you can see is a pre-built module uh, in python if you have downloaded it from its official website that means if you have downloaded python from its official website then you will get uh, this module inbuilt so you directly have to create a file here app.py or anything like main.py then what you have to do is you have to import import tkinter as tk. Then what you have to import is since we are uh, creating a digital clock, so we will be requiring time module. From time import strf time strf time. Uh, what this function will do is. This will basically return the string formatted time. That means the time in the string. Then what you have to do is you have to create an update time function. Update time function. And then you need to set a variable named as current time, which will return the current time uh, from this function in string format. Then you have to label it and replace the text with current time. That means this one. After label, uh, after every thousand millisecond, that means one second, you have to update the time again. Then what you have to do is, then what you have to do is you have to uh, now create your uh, what you can say GUI road equals tk dot tk. This t will be capital. Then you have to title this. This will be our digital clock or clock. Now what you have to do is you have to create a label for this, which we have just defined here. Okay, then these will be our default configurations. And then you have to anchor it in center. That's it. We are almost done. Now you have to create the uh, call the function that is update time. This one again and again. So root dot main loop root dot main loop that's it just save this one now run our program here you can see that this is the font and with uh, font size 40 and this is bold font style you can see you can see the orientation is in all center so we have just created our digital clock using a python code so that's it guys for this video now let's see you next time